Hey guys, oh, welcome back to my channel. Today we are at CVS. We are here to do some deals for the week of September 19th through September 25th. At the end of the video, I will be announcing the Flu's gift card giveaway winner. So definitely stay tuned for that. I'm not gonna lie, CVS is a little bit of a funky week this week. The ad is small and there's some funky issues going on and I'll talk about that after we go shopping. Um, but I'm still very excited for some of the deals because I have a 10 off of 70 scenario that I'm going to do. I've already done a couple scenarios and I got some bounty, so I'm really excited for that or was really excited for that. So don't get me wrong, there is a silver lining always, so it's not that bad, I promise you. So anyways, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm Sarah and I like to coupon here. Make sure that you hit the subscribe button and there will be a Google Doc linked down below for you to make it easy when you go shopping. So anyways guys, let's go inside and see what we can do. So the first thing we're going to grab is the CoverGirl. The CoverGirl is on a promotion where you buy two, you get back $6 in extra bucks. I am going to grab the CoverGirl Blurring Serum for $20.49. And then I am going to grab a little eyeshadow quad that is $6.99 if I can find it. And they have a few left, so I'm going to grab one of these. Then that will bring our total up to $27.48. This printable and the insert coupon for the clean beauty product items do attach to the facial blurring serum. Then I'm going to use this $2 printable for the eyeshadow quad. I don't have insert coupons for this. That's why I'm using these printables. And then I have two $6 off CRTs for the serum. And then I have a 6 off 20 CoverGirl Cosmetics CRT. That's going to bring my total all the way down to $3.48. I'll get back a $6 extra buck making both of these items free and a $2.52 money maker and I will definitely take that and let me know if you guys have used the serum before because I am definitely interested in trying it. Next I'm going to do an epic beauty promotion scenario and we are going to grab some Neutrogena Hydro Boost Serum here. Neutrogena products are buy one get one 40% off. This serum here is $24.49. Then I'm going to grab a Hydro Boost face mask. This is included, and at 40% off, it will equal out to $2.19. And like most times when we have a scenario like this that has multiple items, I grab all the items, and then I go over all the coupons and CRTs. So I will grab a Kiss Balm here. My store has them for $5.79. And then I was going to try and get something that would make my out-of-pocket lower. The store was out. So then I grabbed some Dial Body Wash. They're buy one, get one 50% off. So this one is going to be $6.79. And then I got the idea from Coupon with Star to grab the little bar soaps. So I am going to grab two of the three count bar soaps instead of grabbing another body wash. So that is going to be everything for that scenario. So we are going to be using a four off of 12 dial body wash or bar soap CRT. Then I'm going to use a $2 off Revlon digital coupon for the Kiss Balm, as well as my $3 off mystery coupon from the previous week. It's a mystery or an instant coupon either way. Then I'm going to use a five off of 25 Neutrogena Hydro Boost facial care CRT and then I'm also going to use a $3 off Neutrogena facial moisturizer item digital coupon. So that's going to bring our total down to $26.40. We will get back a $15 extra buck and a $3 beauty buck for hitting beauty and so then that's going to bring our total down to $8.40 which I don't think is that bad considering we got a thing of body wash and that expensive serum plus two packages of bar soap, so I don't think that's a terrible deal, but I definitely have another beauty scenario later on in the video that's much better. So then I'm going to do some oral care. The Crest and Scope and Oral-B is buy three, get back a $5 extra buck, and all of the items are priced at $3.99. So I am grabbing two of the Crest one liter bottles of this mouthwash with scope in it, 
and then I'm going to grab two of the Oral-B toothbrushes. So we are going to have some glitching going on with these oral care items, but we're also going to grab two of the Crest toothpaste. I am going to grab the Deep Clean because sometimes this one isn't included and I like to grab this one. So then our total for everything before coupons will be $23. 94. If you have a CRT, this would be such a good deal. I don't have an oral care CRT this week, but I still wanted to show you this. So this is everything that I have, and the coupons I'm using are the $2 off Oral-B insert coupon from the September P&G, as well as the $2 off Crest toothpaste insert coupon from the September P&G, and then I have a bunch of digital coupons. I'm going to use a $2 off digital for the Oral-B. I'm going to use a $2 digital for the Crest. And then what's also going to happen is that 5 off 3 is going to attach to one of these items. And then the dollar off Crest or Scope mouthwash digital coupon will also attach to these as well. That's going to bring my total down to $9.94. And I will get back $10 in extra bucks for getting the deal twice. So that would make everything here free. But if you have, say, a 5 off 20 oral care CRT, just like a general CRT or a Crest CRT, then that would bring your total down to $4.94, and then you would get back a $10 extra buck. So that is an amazing deal if you can do that. Um, these digital coupons that I have, I have clipped throughout the month and I have no issue with them glitching and working with this type of way because I'm going to clip my digital coupons and if that's how they work then that's how they work. So then the next promotion I'm going to do is the Irish Spring. The Irish Spring is on a promotion where you buy two you get back a three dollar extra buck and they're on sale for $3.99 a piece. Now there are insert coupons which I don't do not have them yet. They're on their way but there is a digital available and there is printables available as well. So I'm going to use one of the digitals. I also have a three off two Irish Spring CRT. So I'm going to pay $4 for both of these, but I'm going to get back a $3 extra buck, making it 99 cents for both of them or 49 cents a piece. Now, if you have a paper and a printable or digital and a printable or whatever mixture you have and that three off two, CRT, then these would be free for you. So definitely a good deal either way. I like to pick these up because a friend of my boyfriend really loves this body wash and he buys it from me. So I definitely pick it up. Then I seen this when I went over to grab a water. This is $2.79 and there's a $2.99 rebate on Ibotta for this, making it free. So awesome. So then I'm going to do some Neutrogena Cosmetics and another transaction. This is an unadvertised deal. They're buy two, get back a six dollar extra buck. So I am grabbing the wipes. Just double check the UPC on these and make sure that they are the correct wipes. These two wipes are the same wipes, but they are a dollar difference. So I don't understand that, but make sure you grab two that are $7.29 because the one on the left here is $7.29 and the one on the right, even though they're both 21 uh, count, that other one is $8.29. So the both of these together will equal $15.58. I have printable coupons that I'm going to use. I have $1.50 off printable coupons. And then I also have some great CRTs. So I have a $2 off Neutrogena Cosmetics CRT. I also have a two off of eight Neutrogena Facial Wipes CRT, and that Wipes CRT is only attaching to the wipes in the makeup section, so just be aware of that. So then that's going to bring my total down to $8.58. I'll get back $6 in extra bucks, making these just $2.58 for the both of them, or $1.29 a piece, and I think that's an incredible deal. So next I'm going to do another Epic Beauty promotion scenario for you. This will be done on another account. You can only do this once per account. So it's a limit of one, 
but I have two accounts and I'm going to do it a second time. I'm going to grab the L Vibe. The L Vibe is two for eight dollars. I'll go over the coupons after I grab everything and then I'm going to grab some Revlon again. Um, yeah, long story, I'll explain it at the end, but I'm going to grab one of these little palettes down here. They're $11.99 and I think they're absolutely gorgeous. So I'm just trying to figure out which one I want. Uh, I love rose gold, ready type of colors. So I'm going to grab one of those. Then I'm going to grab a ultra suede lipstick. I just wanted to grab something different that I hadn't tried before, but these are, I couldn't figure out how much they were. Online they're $12.49. So I'm grabbing one of these and then I'm grabbing two more items and I'm grabbing more Neutrogena wipes, but I'm grabbing the individually wrapped ones for two or for $7.49, excuse me, but they're buy one, get one 40% off. So one will be $7.49 and then another one will be $4.50. So make sure that you, you know, calculate that correctly because that can really mess up your totals and everything like that because I have done that several times and learned the hard way. So that's going to bring our total up to $44.47. I have a $3 off Revlon Eye coupon and a $3 off Revlon Lip coupon. I also have a 3 off 16 cosmetic CRT and a $3 off mystery coupon for the Revlon as well. Then I have a $1.50 off printable coupon again for the Neutrogena wipes and I have a digital version of that also. Then I have a three off of two printable coupon for the L'Oreal L Vive. The digital version of this will glitch as well. So then that's gonna bring our total down to $23.47. We'll get back that $15 extra buck and also a $3 beauty buck because we got $30 worth of items and we'll get another $3 back. So that's gonna bring my total down to five dollars and 47 cents for these six items and i think that's a very very good deal so i like this scenario much better but you know you work with what you got so then i also have a three off two crt for hallmark items and i just fell over when i saw this bag i thought it was just so precious it's three dollars and 49 cents i have two three off two hallmark crts so i'm going to grab this and I thought about grabbing some tissue paper that matches it and then you could, you know, maybe put some goodies in it and give it to somebody for Halloween, like some spooky cookies or something. I don't know. The Pinterest mom in me was going into overdrive when I saw this bag and it just absolutely made my day. So these ended up being free. The one part of my CRT did adjust down, so absolutely free. So next we're going to do the spend 30, get $10 back and I finally found these bounties after the third store. I was so excited to get this bounty. This is an eight pack for $12.99. Seems like a lot, but you're getting a ton. Then I'm gonna grab three bottles of the Liquid Tide for $5.94 a piece. So that's gonna bring my total up to $30.81. I'm gonna show you all of my coupons here in a second. But I want to show you something first before we go over the coupons. So look at this tag here that is on the, you know, the gain flings here. Take a look at the dates above the 494. It says 912 to 925 that the gain flings are 494 on sale, the 14 count. Now they are on sale for 494. But when you look online, it doesn't show that it's included in the spend 30, get 10. So I did see a few people get these and their extra bucks did not print for them. So I think what's going on is that there's just some type of like typo with the tag. That's why they kept them up. I'm not sure. I just don't know. But anyways, they're not included. And some of the other items are labeled this way as well. So I just wanted to give everyone a heads up. I know my videos come out a little later than most people, but um, there's still plenty of time in the week, and it also explains why if you already got the uh, spend 30 get 10 and you didn't get your extra buck back. So little sidebar there, but now we'll go and look at the coupons for the spend 30 get 10 items that I grabbed. 
So the first coupon I'm using is the $2 off bounty coupon from the September P&G. It is expired, but my store and the stores around me will take expired coupons up to a certain date past the expiration date. Then I'm going to use this printable coupon, even though it has the spray in the picture, it does include the small bottle of Liquid Tide. Then I have an insert coupon from the September P&G, and then I'm also using a Tide Liquid digital coupon. I also have a $2 off Bounty CRT. We do have a $2 off digital version of that um, Bounty coupon from the September P&G, but it's not attaching to anything. So that CRT is definitely nice to have. So that's going to bring my total down to $20.81. I will get back a $10 extra buck, making these four items $10.81, which considering that big boy of bounty is over $10, I will definitely take that every day. So next I'm going to do a 10 off of 70 scenario. It includes the spend 30, get 10. And when I seen the store had an abundance of that bounty, I wanted to do the exact same thing again. So I grabbed three more Tide and another bounty. It's going to be a little bit more expensive for me on this account, but I really don't care. That bounty is my baby this week. I just, there's just certain items that we get as couponers that we get really excited for. And paper towel, toilet paper and Tide and Persil are mine. So let me know what yours is. But anyways, I will give you or show you all of the coupons after we grab everything for this scenario because we're not just getting the Spend 30 Get 10. We're grabbing a couple other promotions as well. So next I'm going to grab the Burt's Bees. The Burt's Bees are buy two, get $4 in extra bucks with a limit of two, and they're $4.99 a piece. So I am going to grab four of them, and we have really nice high value coupons for these. We have five off two coupons. Now typically we might see a glitch with this, but these are priced at $4.99. The five off two coupon will come off two of them. When a glitch happens, that means the digital coupon would attach to the other item that the coupon didn't attach to, the paper coupon. But if the price of that item is below the price of the coupon, the digital won't attach to it. So that is why there is no glitching with this this week. That's totally fine. This is still an incredible deal to add in or to do by itself. So next we're going to do the Axe. The Axe promotion is included with Degree, Suave, and Dove. These are buy one get one 50% off and we're going to grab the Axe body spray. I don't know if it's a, like a deodorant or cologne or I have no idea what this stuff is. Let me know what it is because my boyfriend does not use it. So then we're going to grab the Tresemme. The Tresemme is two for $10 and they're buy two get back a $2 extra buck. So that is everything that we are grabbing in our scenario. Our total before coupons and everything will equal out to $70.35. So we're going to use two five off two Burt's Bees coupons from the September P&G. And then we are also going to use a four off two Tresemme coupon from the September Unilever insert. There is also a digital version of this as well on our app and it will glitch with this, which would make them free by themselves. Then we're gonna use two $1.50 off of one paper coupons for the Axe body spray. They did expire on the 18th, but they take expired coupons. Not every store does, but a lot of stores do. Um, and then I am going to use the $2 coupon for the bounty again. And then I am going to use a digital version of the Tide Liquid coupon on this account. And I'm going to use two Tide Liquid insert coupons from the September P&G. Now I don't have any threshold CRTs to use with this because the threshold CRT that I'm using is the 10 off of 70. I actually don't have any CRTs that I'm using with this. So if there are items you want to get and you don't have good CRTs for them, but you have a 10 off of 70 or an 8 off 40, that is a perfect scenario to use those threshold CRTs with. So then after everything, my total will equal out to $30.35.
I am going to help pay my total with a Floos gift card, so I'll get back $3.85. I am also going to get back $10 for the Spend 30 Get 10. I'll get $8 back for the Burt's Bees. I'll get back $2 for the Axe and $2 for the Tresemme. Then I'll submit my receipt to Ibotta and get back another $3 on Ibotta for the Axe body spray and then I'm going to submit my receipt to Fetch Rewards and I'll get back a thousand points for each one of those which is two dollars. So that's going to bring your final total for everything in this cart which is 12 items equaling out to just 60 cents. So those 10 off 70s might seem like they're not a good coupon or we might not be able to you know have a good scenario with that but trust me, this is the second week in a row that I've done this, and it's just amazing. So it's definitely, definitely a helpful coupon to have and keep. So that is everything that I have, guys. Let's go out to the vehicle and look at all of the receipts and our totals. Okay, guys, so I am back in from CVS, and I've gone to three different CVSs. Um, I'm the type of person that I'm kind of stubborn, you know, I have scenarios in my head that I would like to achieve that I prepared for and I want to make them happen. So I went to three different CVSs. The first two that I normally go to every week, just so out of stock of the things that I needed to get in my scenarios. And that's okay. That happens. So I did find one that was a little close and it was like five more miles away. So I went to that one, the one I'm at now, and I was able to finish everything up. So I was ha really happy about that. So the Spend 30 Get 10 is very funky this week because the ad isn't super clear on what's included. And so then you go online and you can see what's included and it's showing very little. So typically our Spend 30 Get 10s are very big, but my guess it's like that because of the Epic Beauty event going on, which this week is the last week for it which I will miss because I have loved doing those scenarios. The tag on the gain flings, and I did show that earlier, the date on it says the 12th through the 25th, which is weird because it's like, it makes you think, is it either or? And it's not. If you look online, it's not showing online that it's included. So um, I will post some photos right here of what I'm talking about as well, just so that you know if you haven't gone couponing yet. What's also weird is the candy CRT. Now, like, I've been getting a lot of candy from Walgreens, and I don't need candy like I need a hole in the head. But I was going to add it to my transaction for the 10 off of 70 in case I needed to, you know, get a little bit over the $70 mark. And I'll explain that, too, in just a second. And my CRT wasn't there. I sent it to my card on Thursday on both accounts. They weren't there today. They weren't there yesterday. So I thought, well, maybe if I go in the store and scan the item, maybe it'll pop up. You know what I mean? I've heard that happening before. And that was not the case. The same thing with my three off of 15 PNG laundry CRT. I had one on both accounts as well, and they were taken off. I sent them to my card and then they were taken off my account. I was thinking that if I did the spend 30, get 10 in my transaction where I use the 10 off of 70, and I have that three off 15 show up when I scan the items, then I'll need the candy to go over the $70 mark. Well, none of them showed up, so I didn't need to do that. But that's why it was funky and it really threw me off my game. But I ended up being able to do all my transactions and my out of pocket uh, was not very much. My actual out of pocket was not very much. I think I spent a total of $8 today which I will definitely take that. But the totals for my scenarios and transactions, uh, some of them are a, a little high, in my opinion. And sometimes that's gonna happen, but I got things that I need. So I'm definitely happy about that. So let's talk about the numbers. So my first transaction was a beauty scenario and Neutrogena makeup wipes. And the total for that was $33.04. I got back a $15 extra buck and a $6 extra buck. So the total for those items was $12.04. Typically, I would not do a scenario like that. But there's some things in that transaction that my daughter uses. So I'm definitely going to try to coupon and save money so that I can give those to her. That's up to you if you want to do that. But that was really the best uh, epic beauty event scenario that I could come up with with what I had in my arsenal. So in my second transaction, I had the Crest and the Oral-B 
an Irish Spring and things like that. My total after coupons and CRTs was $50.64. I got back $34 in extra bucks and I'll get back a $6 beauty buck. I also, I didn't film, I kind of filmed it. Um, it was the Rowdy Energy Drink. We've had it on Ibotta as a freebie for quite some time for CBS. I found it today, so I definitely wanted to grab that. That was $2.79 and I got back $2.99 on Ibotta. Then I used a Flu's gift card that I've just purchased to help lower my out of pocket and then use that to help pay down my total. So I got back another $3.85 for that, making my total for that transaction $3.80. So I think that's a darn good deal for all those items. Then my third transaction was just to spend 30 get 10 by itself. The total for that after the coupons was $20.81. If I had that three off 15 still on my account, then my total would have been $17.81. But I got back a $10 extra buck and for three bottles of Tide and a big thing of this bounty back here uh, for just $10.81, I will definitely take that. So this is my second transaction and I got the Irish Spring, the Oral Care. Then down here I have the Rowdy Energy Drink, which I didn't think I would ever, ever find. Um, then I have the beauty scenario that I did, uh, the beauty event type of situation, and I did it on a separate account that is only a limit of one. And then I did the cover girl and I grabbed myself a water, but I did take this out of my um, calculations. So then here is everything that I was able to use. Here are my paper coupons. There's the five off of three digital coupon, the Revlon lip digital coupon, the Oral-B digital coupon, and the Scope digital coupon. There's the Neutrogena uh, facial moisturizers, the dollar off of Irish Spring, and there's a six off 20 CoverGirl. Both of the $6 off serums come off. 5 off 25 Neutrogena, 4 off 12 bo Dial Body Wash, $3 off, that is my Revlon Mystery Coupon, 3 off 2 Irish Spring, and then I used all of these extra bucks, and that was my total out of pocket. I did pay 10 of that with a gift card, and then I paid 30 cents out of pocket for this transaction. So here is my next transaction. I did the beauty scenario on this account, you know, the epic beauty event. And then I did the Neutrogena makeup and then I did the um, Hallmark because if I have two, three off two Hallmarks, I've definitely take advantage of that if I can. So I grabbed the L'Oreal, the Neutrogena individual wipes and then more Neutrogena wipes. My daughter loves them. So I definitely try to get those for her. I got the Revlon eyeshadow, the lipstick and the gift wrap. Then here are all of my paper coupons that I used. Then the L'Oreal Glitched, and then there is the Neutrogena Digital. There is my Revlon Mystery Coupon and a 3 of 16 Cosmetic CRT. Both of my Hallmark CRTs, the $2 off Neutrogena Makeup CRT, and the 2 off 8 Neutrogena Wipes CRT. And then there are the extra bucks that I used, and then my total was $204. I got a $15 extra buck and a $6 extra buck. And an 8 off 40. Woohoo! I'm so excited about that. So for this transaction, I got the Bounty and the Tide. It's the Spend 30, Get 10. Here are my paper coupons that I used. There's the Tide Digital that I used. And there's a $2 off Bounty CRT that I had. Um, that $2 coupon for Bounty that's a digital is not applying to anything. I hope they fix it. And then I used $20 and extra bucks to help lower my out of pocket and my total for this transaction was just 81 cents. And then my last transaction was the 10 off of 70. I got the Tresemme, I got the Burt's Bees, I did a spend 30 get 10 again, and then I did the Axe. So here are all my paper coupons, everything scanned just beautifully. Then there's a Tide digital coupon, and I do wanna mention that this is on a second account. The Tresemme did glitch. There's my 10 off of 70. I used a $15 extra buck and a $6 extra buck to lower my out of pocket. And then I used my beauty buck to lower my out of pocket. And there is my total right there. Then my last transaction was the 10 off of 70. And my total after everything was 22.20. Uh, I got back $22 in extra bucks. 
So that made my total 20 cents. But then I submitted my receipt to Ibotta for the Axe Spray. This is a new rebate that we just got. And I got back $3 for buying two of those. And then I got back another $2 on Fetch Rewards for the Axe products, making that whole transaction free and a $4.80 moneymaker. And I'm like, what? I'll take it, definitely take it. So that is all of the numbers for everything. So one more thing I do want to add. My first transaction, yes, it was $12.80, but I forgot to tell you, I got an eight off of 40 on that receipt. So yes, I had a hard time finding my stuff today. It took a lot longer than usual. My out of pocket or total for some things were a little bit more, but I got things that we really need and I got an eight off 40. So I'm really happy with that. So let's look at the receipts. So that is everything for numbers and receipts and all that jazz. And now I'm gonna announce the Flues gift card giveaway winner. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put your name up here and you will have until the 23rd to email me. Then what I will do is I will send over your gift card. Now you have to tell me in the email what gift card you wanna get out of the list of gift cards that you can get on the Flues app. So you want Bed Bath & Beyond, you want Amazon, you want Lowe's, you have a $100 gift card of your choosing to any one of those places. And that is amazing. If you wanna do CVS, that's cool too. It doesn't matter, just tell me where you want the gift card from and then I will get that gift card over to you ASAP. So here is the winner, Jennifer Y. Please email me as soon as possible so I can give you your gift card. Congratulations and thank you so much for signing up with Flues and taking advantage of this amazing, amazing app. So thank you everyone who entered and signed up. I would love to do more giveaways in the future with Flues. So that's really all I have, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you were able to get some scenarios and some ideas out of this. And oh my gosh, isn't this adorable? This is so adorable. I absolutely love this. That was another thing that brightened my day. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you all in the next video. Bye, guys. So then my next trip, and then my last transaction was a spent, no, no, this, I keep messing that up, oh. Hey guys, oh, welcome back to my channel. Today we are at, C oh, why am I not wearing sunglasses? Oh, don't have time to do makeup in the morning, I must have my face.